Hey guys and welcome to my channel. This is Nijisa. Yes, and today we're going to take a look at a Tekken move being used in real life, right? In a competition, right? So, first of all, uh, the person that is going to be using this move is none other than Andrea Stojaktinovich. I don't really know much about her. Just from the info here, she's obviously a 22 years old person from Czech Republic. She, uh competes in the 48 kg women's events you know and if you go through the stuff here she's got plenty of war she's a pretty good judoka right like a person who competes in judo and yeah she's gonna do the move so let's go ahead and take a look at which move she's going to be using so she's gonna finish off one of her opponent this was actually the event just happened in 2023 about a month ago uh she ended up getting second place in that event but what she was going to use is this overhead triangle lock right so let me go ahead and roll this slowly for you guys okay so i'm gonna freeze it here bam right so what actually will happen uh, when you guys when we watch the actual clip I'll kind of go over the similar stuff that I'm gonna show you guys here so you know Anna gets the back right it starts from the back and yeah she goes over the top with the legs and she kind of get you know this like crab tight uh, leg across the the head and the arms right and pulling the leg to kind of just secure the positioning but this Andrea's girl she's gonna do it in a little bit different way because in real life it's a lot difficulter and in Tekken it's like super easy right you just do it and you get the full move and the point here is um, Anna's squeezing Asuka's arm and her neck with her pretty much her thighs to be really honest but because you know in-game graphic or, or not so great you know the the positioning is a little bit different too but in this particular scenario what happens is she's gonna be squeezed to choke out right and you're gonna see that Anna's leg here is going to be crossed right eventually crossed to make the tight squeeze choking her out right so let's go ahead and take a look at the real life version okay okay so this is the real life footage right this is actually at the Tbilis uh, competition Grand Slam uh, judo competition 2023 about like a month ago and obviously the Andreas girl is here in the white and she's going up against I can't remember who this person is on the right the blue but it's gonna go real fast we'll kind of try to slow it down so okay of course everything is really very uh, strong and aggressive you know how judos work so she tries this girl tries to attempt you know the throw over but she fails and then kind of like you know what I said earlier Anna getting the back this is kind of similar here right so this Andrea's girl is gonna kind of get the back here but you see so the leg is going over here it's gonna take her a little bit of time to try to get into position she doesn't roll her or her over like in Tekken it actually rolls backwards in this situation here okay so so working to get that hold in working that hold in okay so this position here you see how this arm is kind of like trying to prevent this leg to come over I come under eventually okay so she eventually gets the crab at uh, this leg gonna go inward and she's secure the leg here and then you're gonna see something here that might be disturbing but for viewers like you you probably know what's gonna happen already Okay, so, so you're gonna see this leg here, uh, you know, the leg right next to me right here. It's gonna start shaking, like you know, because she's struggling for air, right? Or struggling just in general because of her oxygen level, right? So, you see how it, it kind of like, you see how it kind of just like tingles and tingle, and you see how uh, this lady she crossed her legs over like this, kind of like what the animation for Anna is supposed to be looking like but it doesn't really look like that and you can see that the referee is doing a bad job because this girl's already choked out at this point and her body is going to be like um just left uh, unconscious 
but the referee doesn't call it. You can see uh, the girl is pretty much done, and you can see this girl is squeezing hard with her legs. I don't know if you guys can see it with that view, but if you guys blow it up, you can see her legs really tightening, like uh, vibrating. And of course, at this point, she realized the girl is completely out. I don't know if she realized it or if the referee called it at this point, but it's really stupid because this girl is literally out cold right now. And the referee is just here, waving, doing something, and nobody's like contending to her, which is kind of weird, because the oxygen level is, you gotta get that oxygen back to the brain, or she's gonna be like brain dead, right? But yeah, so that is actually the end of the clip there, so yeah, um, as far as Tekken goes, we can roll this once more and see how this plays out, right? Boom, right? So, uh, let's roll this one more time and kind of show you guys how it kind of looks like, right? Again, so it's kind of very similar, you know. Sh the only difference here was that girl literally gave up her back, was on her knees already. In this situation, um, Anna actually jumps up as if, you know, and kind of put her into a very similar position but the only difference here is it's almost like at the opposite position right but regardless uh, also in here another thing is Anna's leg doesn't like particularly cross very well compared to like the way that uh, that a girl does it because the in real life it's just different right so let's roll this one more time. I want to try to freeze this frame at where her legs actually cross, but let's see if we can actually do that. Let me just finish rolling this thing here. Okay. Yeah, so right there, you see Anna crossing her legs and kind of like, you know, finishing the choke there. And yeah, pretty much that was the identical move done in real life in the judo competition so yeah there you go